What is happening there is very, very appalling. Your brothers will be lured here that they are going for greener pastures, or you go to Libya, you go to Saudi or other places, you make money and, and so on. Then once they reach there, their passports are seized. They are the mercy of the human traffickers. And then they demand monies from them before they are, they, are, they are released. So the crossing of the Mediterranean, there are many of them, it's not as if they are not aware of the risks. Many of them are aware of the risks. But once you are there in Libya and they are preparing you to cross, if you decide not to be part of it, you'll be shot dead. Because if you escape from that system, you go and expose these nefarious activities. So either you go on the wretched boat or you are killed so that nobody knows about <laughs> what they are doing and nobody can track them. So that is what your brothers and sisters are going through. They will come and lure them. They will reach there, say, bring $3,000 before you get your freedom. If you cannot get $3,000, they sell you to somebody. Then that person will, demand, will be keeping you and be demanding the money and be torturing you every day. If you are a woman, you are subjected to all sorts of uh, 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 things, including rape and other things, until your, your, your family in your home country is able to send the money they are demanding for you to pay them before they leave you. Even if you pay them and you are left on your own, how do you get back to your country? It's another challenge. 